Hitchhiker, Park City. So, Travis and I are driving up through Salt Lake. We get to Park City. We're good. We do a job in Park City. And then we're driving out of Park City to go home. Well, we see this girl. Well, she's probably 30 years old. Blonde girl, backpack on. Looks kind of like a little, looks like a little like a hippie. But I thought, and she was thumbing. And I thought, that's kind of weird that she's thumbing. Why would she be thumbing? That's kind of odd. So I thought, well, maybe I can help her in somehow. Because I had Travis with me and I thought, well, maybe Travis and I can help her somehow. So we pulled over and she ran up and she, she said she needed to get, she had a little sign that she needed to get to Camus. Anyway, I says, what's, what's going on? Um, and her name was Rebecca, or they called her Dino. I says, oh, I says, we're Bruce and Travis. We're, we're headed this direction. We could take you a little ways. You know, she said, well, thanks. Anything can do. And she jumped in and, and she was basically, hit, she was basically hitchhiking up to the high Uintas, which were, had to be 40 miles away, 30, 40 miles away. It was a long way away. Anyway, I didn't want her to get hurt or have anybody bother her. I've had some situations in my life and I've worked with, I work with people who've had some bad experiences. So I says, we'll take you over to the highway, the freeway. And as we took her to the freeway, I thought to myself, we don't have anything to do. We'll, we'll take her over to Camus. Now, it wasn't just Camus. It was Camus to Francis up to the, I can't remember the place it's called, but it, way up in the mountains on the top of the Uanas. It was way up there. It, was, it had to be 40 miles. But she was really nice about it. But I just thought, you know, I wouldn't want my daughter out hitchhiking and some weirdos pick her up and hurt her. So I says, I'm going to take you all the way to where you need to go. We got up there. There was a big, like, hippie commune. I don't know if it was a, a naturalist earth convention or whatever it was, but they didn't want to be filmed. And there was a bunch of, like I say, hippie type people up there. And uh, kind of interesting, but she was really nice. I guess she was a school teacher and she, she, her plane was late. So she missed the bus. So she had to, and her friend's car broke down. So she needed to get up there. And I just, we were just able to help her and it felt really good to help her. It was really fun to get to visit with her. <coughs> so if she ever sees this video, it was an honor to be able to, to help you get to your destination safely.